Assalamu alaikum and very good morning to my lovely students. Welcome back to my mathematics class. How are you? I hope you are all well at home. So, in the earlier video, I already ta taught you the topic of this lesson where to look from about the views of the things that is top view, front view, side view. Yes or no? So, now let's move toward the next topic, right? So, on that... Uh, <clears throat> that topic I already taught you from your textbook page number 1 and 2. So from your textbook I already covered two pages. Page 1 and page number 1 and page number 2. So your let's see on the textbook page number 3. So this is your page number 3. In it you will find like this about the topic Rangoli. Right? So have you ever made a Rangoli? Aapne kabhi aise Rangoli banai hai floor pattern pe? Ya fir aapne kabhi koi jo aapki board hota hai usko chalk se ya fir usse try kiya hai aise Rangoli banana? Right? So ye friend apni Minaksi ka introduction wo raha hai ki wo baut hi achhi si beautiful pattern ya floor pattern dik rahi hai aapne? So aise banati hai. So now here Minaksi giving this introduction that she belongs to Tamil Nadu and make a column pattern using the dot grid. Dot grids मतलब dots होते हैं उसमें, right? I will show you afterwards how what is the meaning of dot grids. So you can also try and use the dots given below to make patterns. Two example have been drawn here. So आपको page three पे दूसरे portion में दिखाया गया है कुछ दो example दिए हैं patterns बनाने का. Let's see. So here you can see. Right? So, dots given below make patterns. Two examples have been drawn here. So, you can see here. You can see two examples here. You can see here. So, here you can see that this is the one that 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 is the one this one also straight line. Yes or no? And this is made using the curved lines. Curved. You can see this curved line. Yes. Right? One more curved line. So this rangoli is made of using curved lines. And another rangoli is made using the straight lines. Right? Now here you can see this is the dot crease that I already taught you. So you can also make. So let me. Let I show you. That one rangoli I am making using this dot line. I will use both the lines straight also and curved. So first I will use which line is this students? Yeah, this is all straight line. Now I am making the square. Square means all sides are equal in length that you know. So I will make it. You can easily see the square. Right? So this I already used the all straight line. Now I am using curved line. Decorate this rangoli. So how I will see use? This is I use curved lines. One more curve line I am using. Then another one. Then last one. Right? So understood? I will use straight line also and curve line also. Make this rangoli. You can also use one more straight line, two more straight lines to decorate it. See, I will make you this also. Okay? So this is how you can make a rangoli. You can also make your own rangoli. Okay, so this is your page 3 over. Now let's see the next topic is make other patterns yourself. Copy these shapes on the dot grid. Right? So note that some lines are the shapes are straight and some are not. Right? So here you have the patterns. What are the patterns? What are the patterns? Some straight lines are made and some are not straight lines. So you can see that it is a straight line. And this is the same straight line. Right? So you can see that it is a straight line. Right? So, you can see below. So, you know that we have seen in the lines and lines in the chapter that there are two types of lines. Which types of lines are there? Two. One is straight line. Right? S-T-R-A-I-G is the straight lines. And another, that straight line is this one. You can see this is a straight line. Right? And another, that is your curved lines. Right? So, curved lines, how you will identify curved lines? In this, can you identify where is the curved line? Yes. This is the curved line. This one also curved lines. Okay. So, now you have to copy this same use in the, on the below dot. So, we will copy first this one. So, here you can see I will use this one, two and three dots and 
four dots then i am starting with this fifth dot so let's see with the fifth dot i am starting so four dot i will be leaving and from this fifth dot i am starting so first i am going to draw this straight line using this all joining dots right then i have to make a like this using a straight line again so i will draw like this then next then next see how i am preparing maintaining distance and you if you want to draw, draw if you are drawing you have to also draw this in your textbook right so if you are drawing you have to use a scale don't draw directly with your pencil use a scale right so that you can get a straight line like this okay so we will draw now next this one using a curved line okay which line i will use now yes we i will use now curved line so see how i am drawing i will start from this next next dot only right so showing how curved lines are there right so i will use one start from this i will start this one first like this i'm drawing see you have to also draw these on your textbook page number 4 complete this exercise you can do it with me also so in your math magics book open page number 4 and complete it you just have to copy whatever it is given right one curve line this i already drawn now i will start this one yeah now we finish this so we will complete this straight line curve lines this two patterns right now remaining you have to do it by yourself maintain the distance of how many it is given that how many dots we have to left and which dots you have to start right so you can do it at your home okay now next phase that is your five so used to dot grid given below to draw your own designs and shapes so आपको यहाँ पे जो है कुछ अपनी डिजाइन खुद बनानी है राइट सो सो हियर आई एम ड्रॉइंग फर्स्ट रेक्टेंगल शेप आई एम ड्रॉइंग सो सी हाउ आई एम ड्रॉइंग द रेक्टेंगल येस इट्स लाइक दिस आई एम ड्रॉइंग द रेक्टेंगल then one more rectangle i am drawing starting from this i am use four dots four and three dots four four dots now i am drawing the square rectangle three then again four dots and then three dots like this all right so now i can also decorate it using one more i am drawing using this slanting line you are aware of this slanting line see i'll draw two slanting line like this now i will decorate it with more yes so here you can see one which shape is this uh, is it look like this is a solid shapes which one this is a cuboid right so you can easily see this is a cuboid that i'll drawing Yes, so you are my one cuboid done. Then one more slanting line I am drawing. Here also I am doing. So you can also make it like this. Okay. Now next is complete this figure to make a squares and rectangles, right? So here the half portions of the given, and we have to complete it. Is it a square or rectangles? That also we have to. Mention it. So let me let help me to find out is it a rectangle or square. So I'm drawing this remaining part. So which shape is this, students? Any guesses? Then next I'm completing four dots and these four dots. So you can see four four dots. It means equal lines. So right. So this first one. Which one is this? Which shape is this? Yes, this shape is a rectangle. So I am mentioning over here rectangle. 
right? And on this, the four four dots mean equal lines. So in which yes, square has a equal lines. Okay. Now next, I am completing this. Next is this one. Again, you can see I am drawing it using a four four dots. That means same equal line. That means this one also square. Next, you can see this one use the six dots and three dots. So that means this is a rectangle shape. You can easily identify. When the number of dots are same, you can see square, and when the dots are different, so we can see the rectangle. This one is square, and this one is a rectangle. Easily you can identify, it, right? Okay. So now let's move towards this next is. I will complete it. So three dots. So I'm also use from all the sides three three dots and drawing this. So see three dots, three dots, and three dots. So you can easily see three three dots same. Equal length line, so this one is a square. Now this is how you can draw. Any guesses, students? How I will draw this? Because it's not easily visible. So this, if I am tilting from the left side, is ko agar left side pe aise karenge, so it will be look like this rectangle, right? So I am tilting. I am drawing it. See how I am drawing. So I will draw a slanting line using a four dots like this, and same. These four dots I'm using slanting, and you can easily see this is your rect square, right? By tilting this square. So understood, students? This exercise also. Okay. So in the next video, I will show you more topic regarding this mm -hmm. chapter. So and. One more time, I'm again reminding you that you have to have to complete your all CW work. And if you have any, आपको कुछ भी query है regarding this, आप मुझे comments में लिखके यहाँ पे आपके video में नीचे comments होगा, तो आप comments में लिखके बेच सकते हो. Stay home, 